You founded Yahoo 15 years ago. You, you're, you know, for the first eight to nine, ten years, really the 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 standard bearer for what it meant to be the internet. Um, you, you know, you made history. You made a ton of dough, um, more than well, a lot of money. Um, you know, then you had this sort of crisis in 06, and you made a decision to come back as CEO. Why? And, and, and why are you CEO now? Like, why, 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 why do that to yourself? Well, I, and are you the right guy? I figured there was a, there was a question in there somewhere. <laughs> um, look, I, I, I've said this pretty openly. I, it, first of all, it was 07 when, we, uh, when, I, when I stepped back in. Um, uh, and there's debate whether I was ever CEO. I think David and I were, for an instant, shared the CEO title in 95. So obviously, between starting the company until um, I, I was CEO last year, uh, I was not. And I felt that um, uh, clearly I was part of a company and, and, and contributed to it in a way that I felt very, very comfortable. Um, I did not, as I said back last summer, I did not make the decision of being CEO very lightly. And in retrospect, obviously, uh, having the company gone through what it's gone through, clearly, um, I don't take my position very lightly. It's a very serious obligation and responsibility. Um, I wanted to make the change at Yahoo that I believe I could make. Um, and it's one of those things where if you um, are able to sort of look at what's happened inside Yahoo, and, and hopefully a lot of you have been at Yahoo, and certainly you've been at Yahoo, um, yes, there's been a lot of change. There's been a lot of people coming and leaving. Um, but the, the plans in which we were trying to execute against from that last summer is being done in a way that I'm extremely proud of in the sense that we're rewiring Yahoo, we're creating Yahoo into a platform company. Um, that was the dream that I, I, I felt that I could achieve by being CEO. Um, and that is still the dream today. And I think that's somewhat lost underneath sort of all the external issues, but I, I feel that's the, the core, um, core identification of what we wanted to accomplish as a company, to become a better platform company on the consumer side, and of course become a better company on the advertising side as a platform company. Um, I felt like we had the talent to do it. I felt like we had the market window to do it. And I feel that um, we have accomplished a lot of those things. Hopefully we'll get to talk about those. But, um, but, but to me, that was the moment in time that I really wanted to um, uh, make that change. And that's something that we've been working hard on and making some progress against. Um, six months into the th thing, we had the external events with Microsoft, and now we have this economy. Now, I, I don't regret any minute of what happened, even though it's not the most fun thing to go through. I think it's just, um, uh, and perhaps I can only talk about it because I've been there the whole time. You know, it's, um, it's a part of me, and, and some people say that's great, and some people say, well, you're just too close to it. I feel like I only know how to operate the way I know by really caring and being um, passionate about what I do. And I'm passionate about Yahoo, I'm passionate about its people, I'm passionate about the mission we've established. Um, and I'm willing to go through walls to do it. Um, and um, and I, I just feel that's, that's, the, that's the reason I'm there.